Yo, never fear, mailman is here, and I'm back with some Need for Speed Unbound gameplay. It is day four of our Everyday Build series. Every day, every day. And what I got for you today is the McLaren F1 1994. Now we all should have got this thing for free because I had got one when I got the volume four and then they sent me another one. So I'm just like, hey, two is good. Today, we are gonna be doing the S plus build. I'll do a S class build later on, but I had already built it for S plus. So we gonna, we gonna do it like it is. This car has the stability. Uh -huh has the cornering, yeah, uh -huh. has the handles. Wow. This thing grips. <laughs> it slides. What this thing does everything. But does it reach its top speed? Don't worry about that. Let's get into the build. So with the engine, we got the 425 3.0 liter inline six. So you got a top speed of two, 31 and you got a 0 to 60 of 2.4 seconds let's go to the parts so we got elite induction elite ecu elite fuel system elite exhaust elite screw supercharger then you got the elite nitrous you got the elite suspension for the road then you got elite brakes elite drift tires you got elite clutch six speed transmission and elite differential and of course your auxiliaries be whatever you want you already know what i'm gonna say you can put in the turbocharger i've tried it and the top speed goes down the zero to 60 goes down you do get a little bit more of that top speed because with the screw supercharger you're not gonna hit 231 at all i mean on the good day you'll probably hit 226 227 but it locks out at like 225. I wouldn't use this thing on like big O or something like that. I would use it on like head spin or, you know, sometimes big city life. When it comes to any course that you're gonna need top speed, I would not use this car. Let's go to the handling. I told you. Don't worry about him. You don't really need that top speed. This car is still a beast. Now with the handling, you're gonna do 80% grip. And I'm telling you, this car grips. Just cause I put drift tires on there, it still grips. But I put the drift tires on there so that them turns, I won't lose any speed. Because like I said, this car, it holds that speed very well. Sensitivity, one click to the left high downforce, traction off, and of course drift uh, entry, gas, brake, default, whichever one you like. If you want it off, that's fine too. You can keep it a grip car. You can go ahead and put the grip tires on and everything. I just prefer to have the drift tires. Now, let's get into some gameplay. All right, let's get it popping. So all my manual drivers, shift it to three, you'll be good. Smooth. This is what I mean. This is why. Why I put them drift tires on there so we can keep that speed up while we're doing them turns. Wee! This thing gone. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Ooh. That's what I'm talking about, boy. That's what I'm talking about. Don't even worry about downshifting. Just keep going. Just keep going. Ooh. Here come this 
traffic right here. Hold on. There's going to be a car. I knew it. Oh, stop playing with them. Stop playing with them. Oh, stop right there. They can get jumpy right there. I don't know what's up with that. They ain't never going to fix it. Slide right in there. Ooh. Ooh. That was legitness. Yeah, it was. Come on. And what I've learned, sometimes when you're losing control a bit, you want to let go of that accelerator. Don't be scared to let go of the gas, you know what I'm saying? Oh, oh, oh. Because I'm telling you, it's faster to just let go of the gas than the crash. Now this car still grips. You just want to put them drift tires on there so that you can slide through them turns real nice and smooth without losing much speed. slow down that's all right see slow down you don't crash you don't lose too much time better safe than sorry you know what I'm saying and there we have it Ooh. McLaren boy this thing is so smooth I'm telling you and don't be scared to mix up them parts you know you could be 80% 100% grip and have drift tires on there just to keep that speed going through the corners. Oh, am I going to DNF them? Oh, you just, oh, you could hear them fly by too. Failure. Well, that was day four of our everyday build series. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the build and I hope you enjoy your races. If you have any builds to share or you want me to do a certain car, just let me know down in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a like and a subscribe. And all my speed hunters out there, stay tuned for the next one. I'm Mayo Man, and I'm out.